It sounded like an ultra MAGA speech to me. Uh, he plagiarized the entire Trump platform. Uh, if the guy had had blonde hair and a tan, I thought Trump would have still been president if you listened to it. I'm not really upset with how people were screaming and yelling. Like, I'm not a big decorum guy. I mean, I'm a decorum person. You are. You that media montage. Being a pet owner, they're like a pet owner whose dog, you know, finally, you know, is potty trained outside and I decided to go, oh, look what he did. Oh, he's such a good little boy. Yeah. They're, they're, they're well, when when he started with the forgotten man, that's when I started thinking about President Trump. Remember, let's make America great again with President Reagan. Let's make America great again. And the forgotten man is FDR. One Republican senator apparently said it, and now they're going to broad brush everyone. And at that point, I don't blame them. They had to take a position. I don't like that it wasn't as, you know, as, as a proper as it might have been. But at that point, there are so many people watching this speech, they needed to hear mm -hmm. that they are not in favor of this and stop gaslighting us, stop lying. And the other thing that, that when he started talking about big oil, mm -hmm. and he says, how dare big oil make these profits and use the record profit to buy back their own stock, rewarding the CEOs and shareholders. We are either a capitalist country yeah. or we are not. And for him to say they shouldn't be doing that is outrageous. And he forgets that he came into office saying, I'm going to shut down the fossil fuel industry. I'm canceling the pipeline. I'm not going to sign new drilling leases. And then he says, how dare you?